everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create. Today I'm going to walk you through a little mini album I just completed using Photo Play Paper Crane Paper. Um, throughout the book you'll see extensive use of die cut stickers and uh, some of the ephemera that comes as part of the complete collection. This is a fun set of papers to work with. Very vibrant, very youthful. On the front I used one of the die cut photo frames so that makes these albums go together so quickly when some of the stuff is already cut for you. I applied some stickers here, here, and here. And then I've left the top open so you could do a, a top load um, of a photo for your feature. This is my niece from Texas. Inside, just a simple flat page here. One of the things I like to do, and you'll see this throughout um, my mini albums, is uh, my black matting either black or, or white matting typically. It's kind of a unifying element. So the tan didn't really do so well against some of the white, so I really wanted it to pop. So in this case, I used black as the mat, and you'll see that used throughout. And I, like I said, I think it's a great unifying element. It doesn't have to be black. It could be a coordinating color as well. On the inside cover, there's a, a sticker that I've matted, again, on the black, because I think it makes it pop a little more. And I've left it open so that you could tuck something in there. First page. Inside, each one of the flaps is a tag. Um, I've put decorative paper on one side and then left blank on the other for either journaling or an additional photo. Okay. And the next page, without a doubt, my favorite is this, uh, this pink cherry blossom uh, design. You'll see I featured uh, a die cut here. On the next page, you'll see uh, kind of a collection of things. One, this is a pre-cut uh, tag from the collection, which I've mounted again, so I think it just gives it a little more substance. Um, this is a piece of the ephemera. Inside, I've, I've put two mounting cards. And then on top of the ephemera, this was just the little girl, I've added these little elements just to make it a little more interesting. Inside, you'll find a tag. Okay, on the next page, this is a uh, sticker that comes on the sticker sheet. Um, I laid the sticker down uh, halfway across paper, it was black in this case, so that it doesn't adhere and can be used to tuck your tags. Another layered sticker is part of the collection, and some location for your photos, and another tag. Pretty simple, basic book, but fun. Lots of fun with the, with the colors. Uh, a nice pre-cut sticker that I've layered here, another flap with some place for journaling and photos. Inside you'll find another tag, and these are throughout. Um, this was, um, and this is kind of a mistake I made actually, I somehow got a little bit of ink on the corner of that page. So um, in order to add some interest to the page and to cover up my boo-boo, I uh, fussy cut a couple of banners and layered uh, a fan on top. So this becomes a large photo mat area and no one can tell that I made that mistake. This is my favorite sticker in the whole collection. I wish there would have been several of these. This is um, a layered flower, um, and it comes just like this. Hard, a little hard to see in the video, but it's, it's actually quite sparkly as well. So I really like this. Inside, location for photos, another mat. Large photo mat location, another ephemera card for uh, photos and journaling. Inside, um, this is our last pocket with a designer page. And because I like the banner of the, on the previous page so much, <laughs> I didn't really need to do these, but I liked it. So I added this feature here too. So the paper crane collection can be found at our shop, www.scrapandcreate.com. And of course you can always use this as a base for your, for your designs. And then I just wanted to uh, point out one more time throughout the book, I did use these, um, these new die cuts from Graphic 45 that fit perfectly on top of their stock. Uh, tags. So these, this is available in our shop as well. You can find us at www.scrapandcreate.com or if you look just below, you'll see a link to our shop. Thanks for stopping by and watching. Have a great day.